Hey you guys, it's Rachel here with Sensei Tempo Kenny Corso. So I'm here with Velocity's babies. Um, I just got done helping Morgan clean out their pen. And um, she, uh, she had to go to work. She's got a new job. And so I'm keeping an eye on them for a little bit, doing some evaluations, and then I'm going to head home. But I wanted to kind of do a little video for you guys and um, <clears throat> let you see them. So I talked a little bit the other day about a puppy that I felt was a doppelganger for the one um, that I like so much out of my um, litter with um, Mad Mortigan and um, Velocity, and that's, that's her right here with the white chin. Um, she's definitely the one that I'm that I'm um, thinking is going to be the same. I'm trying to get out of the light. Um, and uh, anyway, I do have. Um, I was gonna keep two females out of this litter, but I think I'm I think I'm just gonna keep the one because I was um, fixing up kennels today, rearranging, and I just. With everything that I've got coming up, I don't, I don't think I have enough space for uh, multiple females out of the same litter. If I'm being honest, so, um, so I am gonna keep the one female, and then hopefully, um, hopefully, uh, she'll be the one. So. Um, so anyway, so very pretty puppies. They're all doing really well. I'm about to, uh, I've got Wormer on the way. I'll worm them again tomorrow. I've already wormed them once, but I'm going to worm them again tomorrow. And I've already given them, um, their first vaccinations. And, um, and so they're ready to go, pretty much. And they actually are going to be going home very soon. So, um, very excited about that because... We have Wasabi at the house now, and she doesn't have any playmates um, her own age because, um, you know, we just, we didn't have any other puppies that were her age, and so I'll be able to bring home um, this girl that we're keeping, and, and, uh, <clears throat> and that'll be good. So, anyway... But that is, um, oh my goodness. So this guy here, this reverse brindle, so cute. Um, definitely one of my favorite colors, I'm not going to lie. And he's super duper sweet. And he just, he don't want nobody, he don't want nobody getting my attention but him. Nobody getting my attention but him. Booja, 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 booja. Booja, booja. Booja, booja. So, cutie patootie. <sighs> Morgan had this really good idea of doing um, vinyl on the floor, like plastic vinyl, and that has worked fantastically. So, I think whenever I do start having litters back at my house again, um, oh, that I will use that because it's worked fantastically. Absolutely fantastically. So. You're too cute. Look at you over there. He's so adorable. He's so sweet. You're all too cute. I do have a second pick female spot available on this litter. And then I think I have a last pick female spot available on this litter. So, <clears throat> if you're interested... Um, there's some very, very nice puppies in this litter right here. So this one right here, this this one is the girl um, that I think is the one. They both have white on their chins, both this one and this one, but this is the one right here. Um, I think she's, I think she's gonna be the one. So, or at least as close as I'm gonna get to it. 
I think that this one here is more like Velocity and this one is more like Velocity. And that's not a bad thing because you guys know I have Izzy and Izzy has a fantastic head as well. But it's just a different type of head that I'm, that I'm going for. But I got really good, really good heads in this litter. And Don Juan has, Don Juan is a very, uh, um, kind of a very Mastino, I know, a very Mastino looking male. And so I'm really happy about these results because these dogs are more refined than um, I think that I'm going to get out of, out of my, um, potentially out of my litter with, um, with Nirvana and him, if I'm being honest. So I think the structure will be very refined in the Nirvana litter, but the heads, you know, I'm just, I don't have super high hopes because Nirvana, her mother didn't have the best head and she has produced dogs with heads that are like not like the best so i wouldn't be surprised at all if that's what i get sorry i had i had a call coming through that was morgan she was asking me to lock the door to her room whenever i leave but um but anyway overall i'm very happy about the litter um i'm hoping that I'm going to get some size. I feel very lucky that the female that I'm interested in actually does seem to be on the bigger side. Um, obviously, size isn't everything, but when you've seen Izzy, it's like, oh, okay, you know, it, it definitely matters. So I want to, I want to keep that in mind. So I was hoping these guys would kind of chill out a little bit and just spend some time with each other let's see some behavior but I guess they're they're so used they're so not used to seeing me that they all they want to do is get my attention right now can you please sit down and play and be a dog so here's this guy So adorable. <laughs> You're too cute. You're too cute. Yes, you are. You're too cute. Why won't you be puppies? Interact with each other. Uh, these are spoiled puppies. Morgan is spending way too much time loving on these puppies because they literally will not do anything if there is a human in the area. Y'all are too spoiled. You don't even know how to be like dogs. You legitimately don't know how to act. No. I need to see behavior so that I can make good judgment calls. All I can see is a dominant puppy and that's it. All I see is one. <laughs> you guys are really too much. It's a good little batch of puppies, man. Good looking little batch of puppies. So, anyway, it's Aria. Well, I'm gonna let y'all go. Sounds like Ralph just got home, and um, I gotta get home to Savannah. She's calling me earlier, wanting to know what's for dinner. So, I will talk to y'all later, and I hope you have a good day. Bye.